Forget landlords raising rent. The tenants at this San Francisco apartment complex say they were stalked, bullied, and harassed like you wouldn't believe. He actually saw the saw coming up and trying to saw through. Saws, threats, false police reports. This is how far Kip and Nicole Macy went to try to get their tenants to move out. They actually cut a large hole in the living room. The defendants uh, soak uh, the victim's bed and clothes and electronics with ammonia. That's not all. Over two years, prosecutors say the Macy's glued door locks, cut phone lines, shut off utilities, and even had one tenant's windows boarded up while he was inside his apartment. But probably the worst thing they did? They want to make it collapse. Prosecutors say Nicole Macy asked a building inspector which beams to cut to make the apartments structurally unsound. They even threatened this man, a property manager who is also living there. They told me that if I come to the building, they will shoot me. Kip Macy's attorney says branding them landlords from hell is unfair. She says they were naive about eviction laws. I'm not saying, and they're not saying that their behavior was appropriate. They regret their behavior. The Macy's were indicted in 2009, but they fled to Italy. They were extradited back to the United States last month, ending a saga the prosecutor said sounds like the plot line of a horror movie. My goodness, well, I never, Sarah, Sarah Gannon, I, this is unbelievable. Where are these landlords now? Well, Don, both defendants pled guilty to pretty serious charges. Two felony counts of residential burglary, one felony count of stalking, one felony count of attempted grand theft. Now, the plea deal calls for them to be formally sentenced to spend four years and four months in state prison.